In this video, we're going to talk about what the INF6 fault code means and how to resolve that problem on your ATV61 and 71 drive. Um, the first you'll notice is that on the very top of the keypad it will say INF6 there. That's your actual status in real time. So right now, um, it's faulted out. So the couple of things about this fault here, I mean, to get started, I mean, there could be a number of things that are going on. Um, the first thing I would probably have you check here is to go under the um, main menu, go to your drive menu, and go to 1.11 identification. And in here, you want to scroll down and you'll look at two things, option one and option two. So if you have a, a communication option card or any other option cards that can be utilized on these drives, and if it says no option, and if you have an option card actually installed, it could mean that the drive is not recognized in the option card, or maybe it's a bad card, or maybe it's not seated properly. Those all could be your um, possible scenarios there. Um, in other cases, uh, the INF6 can also happen if your terminal block is not seated properly on your drive. And this is your terminal block right here on the bottom. So what I mean by that is, um, this particular slot, sometimes it becomes loose or not seated in properly. And what you can do then is to, you can unscrew this screw here if it's already locked. At that point, you can pull down this card. But let's go ahead and power our unit down here. And make sure everything goes blank. And then we can pull it down because the screw is again unlocked right here. And just make sure everything is nice and tight. Push it back in. And then relock the screw. Once that's done, now we can go ahead and power our drive again to see if the fault goes away. Okay, so now this is ready, perfect. So that was our problem at this point. But again, um, in your case, if it doesn't solve your issue and you have no option cards, and if this is INF6, then I would actually recommend uh, making sure that you remove any wires on the plus 24 and the plus demo terminals on the drives control board, the terminal card we just looked at, and make sure that there isn't anything pulling it down, the plus 24 and plus 10 on this drive. Make sure nothing is pulling it down because if something is pulling that 24 supply down or the plus demo supply down, that'll also affect the um, the actual drives power and it will cause some problems as well. So those are things that I would probably check for this particular fault. Um, as always, if the issue doesn't go away, then uh, I would recommend that you guys call our drives tech support line. But this is basically what I would check for for the, this particular INF6 fault code on the ATV61 and 71 drive.